For the last four or five days, we've had pretty much nothing but clear blue skies. It's been hot and sticky and uh, pretty uninspiring for going out and doing photography. But today I just had to come out and I've literally come about two minutes walk from home to the lifeguard tower here on the beach and uh, I'm doing my first shot. It's about 45 minutes, 40 minutes until sunrise. And we've got a bit of a nice sort of contrasty colour scene in the sky with some nice orange tones along the horizon and a blue sky up above. I've got a composition set up and I'm going to take a picture. I hope you'll enjoy the video. If you do and you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe before you go. Morning everyone, thanks for joining me. It's uh, a nice early morning, we've got blue skies, but we've got a nice band of colour, sort of pre-sunrise colour across the horizon out there. And I've set up a composition. All I've got is the lifeguard tower sitting kind of over on the right hand thirds. The horizon runs across the lower thirds. And what I've tried to make sure is that I've got the coastline beyond completely unobscured by the tower. So the tower has got clear space, a little bit of clear space around it out to the sea. The other challenge I've got is I've got artificial lights behind me and some flagpoles. And what that is creating is shadows in the foreground. Okay, so variation on this one. What I've done is moved in closer and I've gone for a vertical composition. Again, I'm trying to make sure that there's no, none of the distant coastline coming across actually behind the tower itself. Still got a little bit of a glow in the background. Pretty simple. And uh, again, I think it will probably be a fairly high contrast scene, uh, which will hide a lot of the sort of uh, imperfections, the footprints, the tyre tracks, all that sort of thing in the sand. It's getting quite a lot brighter already. So that's probably going to be about a four second exposure. I know this is kind of a scene that I've photographed quite a few times recently. But what I'm doing is another one of these long telephoto shots. Well, I say long, it's, I don't know, 140 millimetres on this, so um, about 200 mil full frame equivalent. Looking across at the distant coastline, the Sierra Lada, uh, the silhouettes of some of the towers of Benidorm, keeping it very minimalist. 
um, and just with that little bit of warm glow coming through. And what I've actually done is I've put on a six stop ND filter so that I can smooth the sea out and kind of blur the whole scene. Going in for one more tighter crop on the Sierra Lada. Sun pretty much in the middle of the frame with a streak of light coming down in the, in the foreground. A uh, little bit of uh, sun flare going on, but can't do much about that. A little bit of lens flare, rather. So I just spotted a fishing boat going across the middle of the scene. I was actually just about to shoot some B-roll and I spotted it and I kind of raced to get in there and get the shot. And I think I might have got it. And that might just add that little bit of extra interest to the image. Well, I think that's it for the morning and it's probably time to pack up and head for home, which is literally about two minutes walk away, which is quite nice. Not too long to wait for my coffee and breakfast. I'm hoping that my next video, I'm going to go out somewhere a bit different. I'm just hoping for some uh, uh, slightly more promising conditions. Although actually this morning has been quite nice. Probably should have gone somewhere else. But uh, we'll see what happens. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a like, share it on social media. Don't forget about leaving me a comment. If you're new here and you've enjoyed this, don't forget to hit subscribe before you go. As always, I really appreciate you taking the time to watch. So thank you very much. And until the next video, bye.